you can't just recently. I'm thinking of, uh, is that MF Doom or is that? Just Doom. Just Doom? Okay. Yukon's Doom. Okay, Yukon's Doom. Okay. So we got Yukon's Doom. And we, okay, so he, here's the thing about Peaches. So we got, we got Thumbs, who's like the best Peach in Connecticut. Doom, who's, I think just as good as, uh, I, don't, I don't know what people, I don't know how people compare Thumbs and uh, uh, Doom, but I, I, see, I, see, I think they're pretty close. And then there's Artie, who's the coolest Peach in New England. Or hey, coolest hey, Peach in, uh, hey. Come on, cuz. Dude, have you seen have you seen Artie like when he was playing? He have, like you seen my pitch uh, have you seen my pitch hitters against him? They're hype. Yeah, you probably get buffed. What? TVH. Because nah, Artie's yeah, so well, good. I beat, I beat him in the friendly, dude. Are you kidding me? It's just a friendly. Can you beat him in a bracket? I don't think you can. Nah, I play him in a bracket, that's the thing. Yeah. Okay, <laughs> so like think about think about uh, Artie's peach. He uh, like, like people, I, people you, gotta, you gotta stitch face immediately. I love that. Oh dude. rip. So, like, those are the best. So what people say why Artie is the coolest, because he like does the sickest combos and he puts like an up air in it, and like Peach's up air is like pretty I'll give him cool. that. He has hit every <laughs> single up air when I was dittoing him. His up airs are amazing. Right? That's why he's the coolest piece. I can't I can't up air like he can, but I don't know. I don't know. I was sick. Thumbs greater than Doom. I was well against him, and then I just get fucked up. Stitch first turn. Lucker. Lucker. Lucker dog. Stitch Lucker. first turn. That's how you know you're a Peach man when you just get Stitch faces as your first uh, turn up. No, that's just pure RNG dumb luck. No, that, 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 that means you're a Peach main. Just like in Luigi. If you're a Luigi main, no, 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 you just no, get if misfires. No, no, if, if you're, no, if you're a Peach main, uh, uh, okay, if you're a Peach main, then what's, some, what's something that Peach should do? If, no, no, if you're a Peach main, you down smash a lot and it works. True. I mean, like, I don't down smash as much you should probably down smash as one. I should. <laughs> Actually, no. But well, is this winner's finals? Is this it? Is, uh, this is winner's finals, I believe. I don't think so. Nah, Toe says nah. nah right? He probably has a bracket open. Semis, winner semis. So Thumbs got Miyagi off the stage. Boom. Yo, is it weird that I'm like the only Peach that can't play well on FD? Like, I can chain grab and I can do all that. It's just, I don't like chain grabbing because I feel like I wilder people with it. Are you kidding me? Yeah. Dude, no, that, that, how that's, do you, that, like, that's I feel really, like it's such a lame thing to do, you know? <laughs> okay, I'm gonna drop some knowledge on you. You know who Infinite Numbers is? Ooh, you know who Infinite Numbers is? Infinite Numbers? He's the uh, he's a ice ice climbers player from New Hampshire. Okay, so do you do you know about Pound 2016 at all? Like I, like as in like what happened there? Not really. I mean, I, I, I'm, when it comes to tournaments like small tournaments like that, I don't really. It's, Pound 2016? It's a big tournament. It's a major. Yeah, I don't know. It kind of felt like Apex to me. <laughs> okay, if you're, if you're uh, uh, get get off the street. We don't need you. Get off the street. <laughs> anyway, so uh, on, on with my story real quick. So if he thinks wobbling and chain grabbing is lame, so we have infinite numbers. An ice climber from like random. Well, to everyone else, it's like a random ice climber from New Hampshire. What made his way up to top eight at pound twenty sixty? His first major, basically by wobbling. Now, okay, wobbling is pretty lame, but like to be top eight and like to, to everyone else to be a random player, that's like pretty freaking impressive. And like. For okay, for a peach player, if you think chain grabbing is lame, then like, how are you gonna be like, if you're playing a best three out of five set and you're playing as like a spacey, right? How are you gonna expect to beat him if you don't chain grab? By like just being better than them, dude. I don't know. Yeah, but like being better is by chain grab because like, what? Because what are they gonna do? They're gonna chain grab. They're gonna chain grab them. They're gonna get tilted. Like right now, Nugget's probably getting released. Really like, what am I supposed to do? Well, oh, okay, he me he messed up the nair because yeah, yeah. you nair at the end. But like, they're gonna get tilted. They're gonna be like, God, this, this like chain grabbing with peach is so brilliant, which actually, which I learned today it's is not. the is the truth. It's actually not. It's a lot. It's a lot oh. harder than you think. To get to get used to it, it's a lot harder than you think. Think, think of how please, long. It, get think, off the street. Think of how please. long. Think of how long. Think of how long it took you to learn how to wave dash. Okay. Okay. That's basically if, how long it took me to if, learn how to chain if grab. If chain with grabbing peach with Peach is hard, then reaction <laughs> technique must be very simple. How long did it take you to learn how to wave dash? A second. I'd say like two days. A second. I, I mean, it, it, it took me like five minutes to get to. to all right. To know how to wave dash. That's it what I'm saying. To, to, to learn how to properly wave dash. But to learn how to properly wave dash took me yeah. like an hour. Okay, but to like wave dash consistently. Can we get I, this I guy off? Can we get this guy off commentary? Can I'm getting. I have AIDS. <laughs> you, have no, you have no idea what you're talking about. I'm sorry. Probably not. Because like, okay, if you're saying that chain grabbing with Peach is hard, then tech chasing with Sheik must be brain dead simple. Is it? What do you? What do you think? What do you think of that statement? I mean, I don't play a, I don't play a lot of Sheik, so I don't really know. No, no, no. But like, when you when you, when you watch like top like top Sheik players like Plop, you know Plop? Yeah, I know. So Plop. when you watch him like Tech Chase Mango, what is it? Uh, what tournament was it? Uh, see, look, 2014, right? 
Okay, so 2014. He was like getting the sickest like tech changes. I don't know. I can't really say if they're reactionary or not because like I don't know. People are on like edge of whether he's actually read based or reactionary or whatever. He was getting like these chain gaps, and then. Oh, don't so if you're, you're on the, if you were on the outside watching that, would you say, is it does it, does it seem easy for Sheik to get those grabs or no? I mean, like after a while, you just know how to read people and then just grab them. But like, right? no, no. But reaction tech chase, tech chasing on reaction. Would you say that's hard, easy or hard? Probably a little hard. Probably. It is. Hard. It is close to impossible. Let me let me drop some so? let me drop some knowledge on you. Right. <laughs> okay. Let me, so let me, let, let me know some let me know <laughs> so, some chic knowledge right here. So against Fox, Fox or Fox specifically, do you know what frame their shine comes off? Or it comes off on one. Yes, one. Okay. And do you know, and then do you know how hard it is to grab them before they gra actually shine? Grab them. Uh, uh, to grab them on like the very first frame of si si very first frame of 60 frames, it is close to impossible unless you know they're gonna go for it. No, no, you just know you just know how to grab. Yeah? Okay, but it is so hard yeah. to do. Yeah, so no, no, the time the time can be really annoying. <laughs> yeah. it, I am so done with this. <laughs> anyway, but like back to this match. Bas uh, I don't know. So, uh, Thumbs uh, Thumbs basically won the first match with the down smash. Uh, they no, were no, with chain really grabbing. Like yeah, I told that, yeah, you, that too. Grab. Yeah, that too. No, but I mean, at the end, he just finished him off with the down smash. Anyway, so basically, uh, I think, well, first first match was on FD? Yeah, first match was on FD. So I don't know. Oh, no, no. Is this 3 out of 5 or 2 out of 3? This is a uh, 3 out of 5. Jimmy! Yeah. Is, this, is this 3 out of 3? 3 out of 5. Oh, 3 out of 5. Okay, so yeah. no bans. So, um, yeah. This is the counter pick, I guess, by Miyagi. Uh, I mean, it's like it's like it's not a bad counter pick for Miyagi, but like, no. I don't know. Well, I, I I like Pokemon Stadium with Peach, honestly. I think it's no, no, no this is this is Miyagi's counter pick. Yeah, Miyagi no, no. I know, I know, but I'm just saying, like, well, I, yeah, yeah, yeah. when I play Peach, I actually really like. Uh, yeah, because like, Stadium. yeah, because um, for for at least the uh, Peach, since you don't have like that top platform and like the two side platforms are like pretty far from each other, you can, it's like it's kind of like FD except for like two platforms. So you can you can get like chain grabs like like a little bit easier than you would on like the outfield or something. But Indeed. Oh. yeah, so I don't think I don't know if Miyagi's if this counter pick would work. And then Max with his chain grabs would never miss. Or met with the edge guards never misses them. That was very good uh, edge guarding by thumbs. He times his uh, nares really well. I can't. I, I'm really inconsistent with the timings when it comes to edge guarding people or uh, edge guarding spaces when they're anything uh, with a nair because a lot of the times their upbeat kind of just hits me oh, before I get combo. to nair them. Yeah, go. Thumbs is really good. <laughs> Comboing people with beach, my god. So I think like um, what Miyagi needs to do right now, uh, okay. He, he, I think he needs to be a little bit more careful with like his approaches and like during his like his combos, like not miss like an L cancel, otherwise he's gonna get grabbed for it or get like punished for it or whatever. You whatever try, Peach does. You can try grabbing the um the turnips too. I know I know it's really hard to people who don't have items usually to throw and stuff, but uh, if you can get used to grabbing Peach's turnips, it might actually help a lot. Uh, yeah. I mean, yeah, more or less. Max, uh, Thumbs isn't really, like, the kind to, like, pull a lot of turn-ups. Yeah. So I think Miyagi's just going to punish him on the fact that, like, oh, he's going to have a turn-up, and then I could probably find an opening a lot easier than if he would. I mean, but he messed something up, he's going to train grab. But he had the platform to save him, so he's all good. And he's going to camp out with lasers, but, uh, yeah, that was kind of fear right there. <laughs> Oh boy. Uh oh. That, that was a mistake by Miyagi right there. Complete mistake. Sheik is a brain dead character, by the way. Says it, Sheik, says it, says it right there in the Sheik is chat. not brain dead at all. <laughs> um, Niren. I, could t I wish I was a mod. I would time you out in a heartbeat. <laughs> <laughs> anyway. Oh man, um, Niren's gonna get it. I'm not gonna talk about Sheik because Sheik's not on, but if I do Sheik, Sheik I'm gonna be all over it. Because I know Sheik. The only character I play is, so what the fuck. Um, Let's see what Miyagi chooses against uh, Thumbs. Po oh, Pokemon Stadium again. <laughs> I don't. What is Miyagi doing? Honestly, I'm not I sure. think I, I would have picked Yoshi's to be honest with you. Yeah, yeah. I, yeah. I think Yoshi's just two. Oh uh, yeah, two, two zero. Oh, yeah, it's two zero. Two zero Thumbs. I mean, I guess Miyagi's like maybe he maybe he feels like. Um, maybe he like thought about what he did like the last match and like okay well if I don't do this I might have a better chance because like Pokemon as I confirmed earlier has a low ceiling so Fox well if he doesn't mess up his tech skill then he's just like drill shine up smash and then like rinse and repeat until he gets the kill and then just like yeah whoop drill shine if you uh, had brain here you'll understand how brain dead she is Kappa 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 <laughs> well if Sheik's brain dead 
and then what is it? And if Slox is picking up Sheik, then that means I'd be I like when I when I saw when I saw Slox I'm so done with Sheik, this. When I saw Slox playing Sheik, I just I, I couldn't believe how good his decision making was. Okay, I got it, I got it. So if she if Sheik is a brain dead character, then what is it? And tech chasing must be really tech, tech chasing direction must be really easy, and making reads must be like the easiest thing to ever to do with Sheik. I think the I think the thing that saves Sheik from uh, being Which brain dead hard. from being brain dead is like you need good decision making with Sheik in my opinion. Uh, you need to know when the you need to know when the side tilt. You need to know when to when to up tilt. I guess fair is always a good option to just cover almost everything. But like with Peach, you can just kind of like spam moves, and yeah, you'll get punished for it. But with Sheik, if you spam a move, I'm pretty sure you'll like. You will definitely get punished for it a lot of the time. Mm -hmm. If you miss a fair, you're gonna get punished for it because it just lasts way too long. Well, I mean, for Peach, the only move she really can, quote unquote, spam is like down smash. But like obviously, Back air, you're, nah, air. what Peach? Yeah. Not really. Think Cause, so. No, no, because like, well, back air is what you use to like finish off combos. Um, hang on, Tyler, did I, did I work for it? Uh, <laughs> what was going on? What was I talking about? I lost track. Oh, oh yeah, yeah, yeah. She, Peach's bear and stuff. Uh, well, I mean, you can't spam it. That's more of like something you do like during a combo or like to like edge guard. But uh, like, I, it, like I depends spam on it and it works a lot of the time. Then fair whoever you're playing must long. be pretty bad. Yeah, probably. <laughs> fair lasts wait. What Peach's fair? Oh no, he was. I was. I, I was saying that fair lasts way too long. No, it doesn't. I think it lasts quite a while actually. Well, maybe it's just me because I know how to like <laughs> avoid it and then just counter it immediately. Uh, I, I played a lot of Sheiks. Well, what is it? For like moves that left. Miyagi beat Eric and Anthony. Uh -huh. Hey, it's CT. Miyagi beat Eric and Anthony. Yeah, uh, Anthony? I don't know about Eric? that, but he definitely. Well, he beat. Okay. Fury, Xavier, 